All right, so we have Izzy here um, for exit interview after the season's done. Um, yeah. yeah. So let's start. All right, uh, second place. Can yes. you tell us your story? What do you think your best move was? I think my best move in the game was re-allying with Cassidy after the merge to get Liam out. Mm -hmm. um, I think that was my best strategy along with um, keeping up uh, my alliance with Evan until we ended up getting Liam out, like keeping that a secret from him. All right. What do you think your fatal flaw was? Like, why do you think you ended up in second place instead of first? Um, because I have the brain cell of a lettuce leaf. Um, and whenever people ask me things like, what are my strengths and things like that, I cannot tell you, like, right off the top of my head. Right. No, I mean, I relate. Yeah. As, as a fellow second place winner, <laughs> yes. um, last, like, the last final tribal, everyone's asking me questions, and I was like, I forgot what happened this season. Yeah. And you guys were, you, you know, there for 11 yeah. weeks, and we were there for, like, six. So, yeah, like, no, it was more than 11. Brain, but... brain was gone, and yeah. also, um... Oh fuck, what the fuck was I gonna say? Yeah, uh, I think like one of my regrets of the season was not playing a bigger social game. Because mm -hmm. um, like first semester was rough for me and uh, I have a hard time like, like keeping a dialogue going with people sometimes it's like I don't know what to say exactly right so I just don't say anything at all and I think that was probably also a flaw not building better alliances right yeah I mean okay yeah yeah um but you you, you definitely ta talked more than like you know Matt yeah so uh -huh. don't like don't I talked more than yourself... I talked more than Claire yeah like give yourself credit yeah you know? yeah um, all right, so what were your plans for that season since the beginning? Like, what, what did you want to achieve? Um, honestly, like I said at Final Tribal, like, uh, the, my, I came into this, like, just, uh, wanting, like, something social to do. Um, I think my, honestly, I did not expect to get to second place. I thought I probably would have been maybe, like, sixth or seventh place. Right. Um, but... I think, like, as soon as the game got started, like, my goal was to be in first, um, until Cassidy reached out to me, um, and then we formed an alliance, and then our goal was to, like, or my goal at least was to make sure we were always, like, in the top two, and it obviously worked out that way. Right. Were you satisfied with your performance this season? Uh, like I said, uh, I wish I had played a better social game. Um, some of the physical games I also didn't put my best into, but I think that's kind of unavoidable since we are playing this on top of doing schoolwork and things like that, and we don't always have time to put all of our, like, all of ourselves into Survivor. Um, yeah, I mean, yeah. it's Denison. So. It yeah. is. <laughs> Academically rigorous is their only selling point, and that's literally Hey, it. at least their catchphrase is not what my high school um, was, which was a uh, cause where academic excellence is the standard, not the exception. No, there's another selling point for Denison. It's called Denison Survivor. I don't know if you guys have heard of it, but it's It's founded by where, Noah Chartier. Uh, um, all right. I, yeah, um, we're over, but... Overall, what are your opinions on the castaways that you met? Yeah. Um, everyone post-merge was really cool. Uh, I liked all of them. All the people pre-merge, I didn't talk to many of them, so I didn't really get to know them. And Fair. That's, mm -hmm. kind, of, that's yeah. kind of what it feels like most of the time. Yeah. I think. Uh, our, our, our strategy when we were first in teams was like, we're just going to vote off the most inactive people. Yeah. So that I think that's why it ended up like that. Yeah, that okay. seems to be how it is for each season. Yeah. First season was very I much mean, like that. Yeah, the it only is strategy. We got by that quicker, though, first season. Yeah, the only one in season one that I think that, that, that was, like, active pre-merge was, um, well, was, like, Alex. Because I know, like, Scoos and um, Mason, or Jen and Mason, they, they, um, they weren't very active in Survivor, but then they, they were having fun in production. But um, mm -hmm. uh, most people... 
pre-merge don't end up. And I think this season also wasn't helped by the fact that it was so long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 No, I know yeah. uh, Amy kind of gave up at one point. She was just like, just vote me out. I don't want to do this anymore. Yeah. So, yeah. Still have not done an interview with Amy. <laughs> yeah. Don't think we Amy has not will. been interviewed. Nope. But so is, neither has Isabel or Duncan or Abby, so. <laughs> or Matt. <laughs> well, we're Matt, but I didn't... Matt's Matt. Watch his senior year, Matt actually kind of <laughs> finally we comes do Matt to do hunt. the <laughs> Matt hunt. Yeah. Okay, um... New Survivor Challenge. Well, if you... Okay, um... Never mind. Because it was, like, one of the questions was, like, if you... Who would you vote for at Final Tribal? So I was, like, trying to think, like, if you were voted out in Margaret's position, would you have voted for Margaret or would you have voted for Cassidy? At that point, yeah, I probably would have voted for Cassidy. Yeah. Because um, I didn't... I also didn't interact that much with Margaret. Um, right. So, yeah, I probably would have interacted with... Or I would have voted for Cassidy. Yeah. Um... So Cassidy won. Did you did you think she was gonna win overall? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, like part like a small part of me was like, hey, maybe I could win, but I, the rest of me was like, no, Cassidy obviously has this in the bag. Mm-hmm. She played the best like social game yeah. and everything. So, she yeah. played the best everything. Like she mm-hmm. killed it. Like this the, the this was a this was a power season. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think Although you. Yeah. I I was thinking that. Um, like, at some points, I thought, like, she did have an advantage being on... Was she on production, or was she just spectator last season? She was season? production, no, she was production Yeah, last I feel like that might have given her a small advantage, yeah, but, but not, also, not like, that big. Because production advantage. last season was completely different than this season. Mm-hmm. Like, the season, we've, like, been in here since the start, and we've had, like, lots of different roles and stuff like that. And, and yeah. a lot of things have changed from last season yeah, to this yeah, season. Yeah. That's why I didn't, I didn't think it would yeah. be a huge advantage, but it would have been a small mm-hmm. advantage. And, you know, if you want, you can apply for production when the, the forms drop. Mm-hmm. Is only host open right now? Currently, yeah, only yes. host right now. When does production drop? No clue. I, I also don't know. Any host. <laughs> and I'm a host. <laughs> so. Um, yeah. So, since we can't ask you if there's one more message you would like to send to the Discord, um, how about we ask... I mean, you still could ask that if I could send one more message to the Discord because um, it's locked down now. Well, that's not as fun. Um, okay. Since you made it to second place, yes. what would you say to incoming castaways? Buckle the fuckle up. It's gonna be a rough ride. <laughs> um, no, uh, generally you do, you, you do meet a lot of cool people here. It is fun. Um, just make sure you're not putting it over your academics because um, those are very much important. Um, yeah. But yeah, it, it's a good it's a good opportunity to meet new people. I know I met a lot of cool people through this that I probably wouldn't have otherwise met because I'm so bad at meeting new people. Uh, That's yeah. It. But then you did Survivor, so yeah. you yeah you put yourself out there. Yeah. Um, do you have anything else you want to say to the spectators? I would say to the um, future castaways when it gets like you know put in public, but it is public. We're gonna straight public for this one, so. Mm-hmm. What would you say to any of the viewers at home? At, at wherever they are. Yeah. Maybe Slater. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Um, to the viewers at Slater, get the bow buns for dinner. Highly recommend. Good shit today. Um, for the viewers on Denison campus, do you think we need a ski lift for the Eisner Hill? And for the viewers who are not in Ohio, or just not on Denison campus, um, why have you not transferred to Denison and signed up for Denison Survivor? Pretty sure that was at you, Alexandra. That was at you, Alexandra. Get over here. Yeah. All right. Um... Yeah, I think that's a wrap. Thank you for joining us on an interview. Very nice. Thank you. Hell yeah.